guys, Sean here with Spencer's Lawn Care. And uh, just to clarify with everyone, my name is Sean Spencer. I get asked so many times. In my area, it's very common to name your company after your last name. There's quite a few. There's, uh, I'm not even gonna name them, but there's quite a few. Everybody knows everybody by their last name. So, if anybody needs to know from here on out, if any guys just want to respond to him, no need to be rude or anything, just tell him, hey, his name's Sean Spencer, he uses his last name as Spencer's Lawn Care. It, uh, it's kind of like a, like a family name almost, you know? Whatever. But hey, it's Sunday the 31st, and, oh, uh, I made a freaking rookie mistake, boys, rookie mistake. Yesterday, I took yesterday off to spend family time with the with the family. Well, it's been like 95 degrees here for the last week or 90 degrees for the last week, week and a half. And I just assumed it was gonna continue. Well, that didn't happen. Woke up this morning, down pouring. Well, guess what? It's my commercial day. Can't miss my commercial days, guys. Just ain't no ifs, ands, buts about it. I mean, I don't give a shit if it's porn. They gotta get cut. They gotta look good for the week. And they gotta be cut on the weekend. And for a few of you other guys that ask all the time, well, why do you work Saturday? Well, I work Saturday because the commercials I have, they, well, two of the commercials I have require me to have to only mow on the weekend or basically at night or late in the day super late in the day like after all the employees leave they're gone you know second shift or whatever it would be like 10 11 o'clock at night so I'm not down with that so I just do it on the weekend uh, which is no problem you know I'm paid really well to do it like that you know and sometimes to uh, you know, to make your commercials happy or whatever, you gotta you gotta do them on the weekends. You know, I'm like anybody else. I'd rather have Saturday and Sunday off if possible. But hey, I like money just as much as I like Saturday or Sunday. So therefore, if I gotta work one of them, I'm gonna work one of them to make that money. So, got the trailer. I don't know if you guys see it or not. It's downpouring, boys. Yep. Hey. Sitting here, see the trailer in the background. Everything's getting a wash today before it gets dirty. So, oh yeah. On. Sorry about that. I had to reject the call real quick from my uh, wife. But no, uh, I'm also going to be picking up a guy here to help out today. I might, uh, I'm gonna see how it goes, and if it goes good, I'm gonna hire this guy for one to two days a week, possibly for the rest of this season. Uh, basically, it's gonna be, I say one or two days, because it's really gonna depend on, uh, you know, how much he has free time with his schedule and everything. I've talked to him a little bit about it. He said he can do one day for sure. So, we'll see. He, uh, he definitely wants to go full-time next year. So, I mean, he might be the right guy. He's got experience. He's uh, he's owned his own lawn business in the past years and years ago, like 15 years ago. So, I mean, a lot of things have changed in that time period. A lot of equipment has changed. Uh, mowing traditions have changed a lot. I mean, not quality, everybody. You know, there's always been a quality cut, but I mean, striping's a lot more bigger of a deal than it used to be. Well, at least that I can remember. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to be picking this dude up, giving him a try today. So, we'll see how it goes. I'll uh, keep you guys updated, keep you tuned in. Oh, man. I just did not want to see freaking rain today. It's Sunday as that. You know, it's... It's Sunday, and then it's freaking raining. I love the rain, don't get me wrong. 
I love the rain because it, you know, it makes the stuff that makes me money. But damn, why'd you have to rain today? Keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. Later. What's up, guys? I uh, figured I'd give you a quick update. The new guy is fucking awesome. No joke. Experience is well worth a little bit more money, guys. No joke. He's uh, he's down there. I ain't have to tell this dude shit. I just had to explain the property to him. And he went, man. He knows what he's doing. Give you guys a little BR 600 action. Not really a whole lot to blow here right now, but I always make sure I do the walkway where they walk into the building. because you know that's where all the that's where all the people that will pay your salary or your weekly checks that's where they walk into the building and if they ain't happy your checks ain't gonna be happy See if I can get a little something. Check it out guys, dude just pulled in right next to my truck, probably going to be a potential customer. New guy's talking to him, 